Indonesia was my first international trip as a Miss Universe. It was such a busy trip. We had like a million events. We were to an event, to another one, to another one, to another one. It was non-stop, non-stop, non-stop. So we didn't waste a minute. I wear beautiful dresses and they were all made by Indonesian designers. I worked every day with talented Indonesian people. They helped me with the wardrobe, with the makeup, with the hair. And I really felt beautiful, confidently beautiful in every event. So thank you to all the designers. Indonesians really love beauty pageants and really love Miss Universe. I've never seen that kind of enthusiasm. My first event was the Putri Indonesia pageant. I was in the audience, but later they brought me on stage and they asked me for my favorite Indonesian food and I said, Yeah! Really? Thank you. So after the pageant, I went with a new Putri Indonesia to different malls around the country. There were photographers everywhere and then I get a foot massage. One of the coolest things that I got to do during the trip was painting a batik and it was so difficult so I really don't know how they do it. I really don't know how you guys do it. So difficult. I got to be on TV in the Rendezvous with the Miss Universe TV show and it was so funny because the host asked me to teach him salsa dancing and he couldn't move but for payback he asked me to dance Indonesian music. I think that the best part of the whole trip was the kindness of the people. They really treat me like a queen. Uh, in every part that I went to, they give me a gift. I come back to New York with a suitcase full of Indonesian stuff. I was so sad when I left the country, but I'm sure that I will come back. So, until next time, Indonesia.